So Mike, this weekend we've been getting all the cold, but none of the snow that I, at least I love. So what's going on? I don't know that that's going to change this weekend. I'm sorry. Thank we're going to be the apology. Yeah, we're just going to be stuck fault. in this pattern. I mean, <laughs> you know, really can't move forward. I don't think with snowstorms, things like that until we get just a big pattern change. Maybe as we get into the start of February, but even then I'm cautious. Let's talk about what Betsy sent us today. Ben Betsy sent in this picture from Rockwood and the caption of it was we need more snow. And you know what? I have to agree this month really not all that impressive. I've been tracking little snow squalls to watch these numbers climb. Here's the January snow so far. I've been showing this the last few days. We picked up one tenth of an inch in Bangor yesterday. We're up to 9.8 inches now for the month in Caribou, 3.9 inches so far in Portland. So below average just about everywhere, and I really don't think that's going to change much moving forward. High temperatures today were cold again. We did eventually make it to 31 in Portland, 30 in Sanford, topped out at 25 in Augusta and Wiscasset, 23 in Bangor and Teens in western and northern sections. We won't be quite as cold this week. However, we will see some storms that stay to our south and maybe just maybe we can get a few flakes to move through on Tuesday. Radar tonight will stay clear and quiet. Really not much else to talk about. Lingering cloud cover with the northwest wind in northern New Hampshire and then the western mountains of Maine. But again, that will mostly start to break apart tomorrow as high pressure moves in. Expecting a lot of sunshine tomorrow afternoon, mostly sunny skies. Temperatures topping out in the 30s along the coastline. Central Maine going to be in the upper 20s and then colder as you head north. Beyond that, though, the storm track stays suppressed into our south. So here's our next storm. But take a look at this right here. The decaying low pressure maybe will be able to bring just enough moisture through to provide a little bit of maybe some snow flurries or freezing drizzle, something like that, Tuesday night into Wednesday morning. So there's a small chance, especially in western Maine, that we'll be talking about some slick spots for Wednesday morning. But beyond that, really not much else. This is going to be an impressive storm over the mid Atlantic later in the week, but that misses us too. Really not much else uh, to talk about with that one. The jet stream has just favored keeping those storms to our south. And the reason for that, you see this trough right here. That's the energy for that storm. As the jet stream actually flattens out, it favors pushing that storm away from, uh, from us and keeping it south. High pressure to the north blocks us and ultimately keeps the dry conditions here. So what else to look forward to? Well, let's talk a little bit about February. I know this is eight or nine days out, so a lot can change, but this is the only chance of appreciable precip say that five times fast over the next few weeks. Even uh, looking in the long range, I just don't see a big pattern change that would favor a lot of storm activity. So we'll take this, of course, day by day and see how it all works out. But if you're waiting for snow at this point, you might as well just start looking toward the new month. Seas tomorrow, 2 to 4 feet northwest wind, 15 to 20 knots with some freezing spray in the morning. There it is, morning flurries on Wednesday. There's a chance that we see some flurries again on Friday, but I just don't see this amounting to anything. I don't really see impacts from this. It'll be breezy on Friday and Saturday, especially Saturday. It's going to feel cold, very similar to what we dealt with this weekend. And then by Sunday next weekend, Hannah, we'll start to warm things back up. So. I hope you'll forgive me. Maybe on, in February we'll be talking about more snow. Maybe. I hope so. Mike, do you remember that ad that we had with Jess Connolly doing, uh, she was flushing ice down the toilet, sleeping with, what, what was it, a spoon under her pillow, yes. all the snow superstitions? Yeah. Well, we that's to, going to be me. We need to do that as a station, I think, yes. to bring some as snow back. As a state. Yeah. Let's, let's all get together, Everybody guys. in Maine. <laughs> all right. Thank you, Mike.